Welcome back everybody. Moving on, the second task we're going to be looking to do with our linear graphs assessment is can you get the equation from the graph? We are still working with y equals mx plus c. The gradient is m and the y-intercept is the constant term c, but in this case, instead of you being given the equation and you have to draw the graph, we're just going to do that in reverse. Here, we are going to be, you're going to be given the graph and now you're going to be asked to make the equation. So, we've got our x-axis here. We can see I've got an O around the origin at the point 0, comma, 0. This is, of course, where the x-axis and the y-axis meet. First thing, where does the graph cross the y-axis? So there's my y-axis. We can see there is 0, 0. It crosses the y-axis at 1. That means that this constant term and the y equals mx plus c, that value is going to be 1. So let's start with our blank y equals mx plus c. Well, we know that the y equals, that's always going to be like that. The x will always be there. Your job is to calculate the gradient m and find what c is going to be. And in this case, because our line goes through the y-axis at the point 1, we know it's going to be point 1. Cut pi. Now we want to figure out the gradient. And my suggestion there is find points on the line that are at the intersection of the background grid. You can see I've got the grid in the background, those little dashed lines. Well, you want to find a point where the background grid crosses. Now, this one here, it doesn't meet where I've got the cross, so I'm not going to put a dot there. There's one that meets there, it meets there, it meets there, and what I'm going to do from there, I'm going to count off the rise over the run. We know on this one, the y-intercept was 1, now let's count off the gradient, the rise from this point to this point. How many do I rise or go up? One, two. So that means two is the rise. One, two. Now how many do I run over? One. Well, what's two over one? Two. That means the gradient m is two, and the equation of that line is y equals 2x plus one. Y-intercept is one and the gradient was 2. Now you know how to find the equation of the line if you're given the graph. Copy. 